Well, 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 let us see what is the next best thing that Blender has to offer us. With that being said, and then I will go to File, go to New, and go to Sculpting. Let us have a fresh file, and then I will click and drag here so that we can see the names of the brushes. And today's special guest is Multi Resolution Displacement Eraser. It's called as Multi Res. This is useful when we have Multi Res modifier applied. For example, I have clay strips here and if I click and drag over here, there are clay strips over there and what we can do with this is, if I bring this down a little bit and go to the modifiers property panel and add a modifier named multi resolution. This is also known as multi res. So what we can do is, uh, we can click on subdivide. So it is being subdivided, if I go from overlay from Y. Uh, to the wireframe uh, in this parameter if I go to zero then uh, this is our base default mesh because I have subdi subdivided it one time so we will be going from zero to one and the mesh is becoming a little bit dense if I subdivide it once more the mesh is going to become more dense so what is the utilization what is the use of this so for example let me switch off the wireframe and uh, I have two strokes here uh, let me show you what multi -res, uh, multi res modifier actually does I will go to sculpt two two values in the sculpt and now if I click and drag over here I am clicking and dragging and creating a stroke over here now if I go back to zero and click a stroke over here and uh, come back to the sculpt and click it back it is going to overlap the multi res modifier stroke over my default stroke so that is how multi resolution stroke works it applies itself on the stroke we have applied when sculpt was 0 and uh, we can increase this value by using the subdivide but make sure uh, that your uh, computer has enough resources to do that or else it might get laggy so what actually multi res displacement eraser does is it erases whatever we have done with the help of multi res modifier now if I click and drag over here all the multi res modifier strokes are been erased except those which have been painted when the multi res modifier was zero multi res sculpt parameter was zero so if i click and drag over here this multi resolution stroke will be erased and our normal stroke will be maintained so that's how multi res displacement eraser works I hope you are liking this video if you like this video hit the like button hit the subscribe button hit the share button and leave a wonderful comment uh, if you want to support me you can watch the entire ads which are following on this videos completely so that the ad revenue which is generated completely goes for the research and if you want you can support me through google pay phone pay pay uh, paytm on 86006477757 or you can also support me through patreon's page what you need to do is go to Google Chrome go to YouTube and search for blender Veda and uh, any blender Veda video it doesn't matter English or Hindi then go for a description and in the patreons here click on this link it is going to take you to a web page from here you can join for the one dollar three dollar nine dollar or whichever you want to pledge so uh, that's how you are going to support this channel uh, with that being said and then try to see it learn it understand it i will see you in the next video Amazing.